Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a three box break of, of that right there. This is random team break number one of 2019 Gold Rush autographed football jerseys. We're doing a half case break. So six boxes in the case behind me, we're gonna do half of it. Big thanks to all of these folks right here. Joe P getting a last spot mojo. So thanks to him. Thanks for his patience as well. Let's double it up because one spot gets you two teams and all 32 teams are in. Let's roll it and rando it 10 times, four and a six. Your name's first, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10th and final time. After 10 times, we've got Roy, who I saw earlier, aloha, down to Sean. And four and a six, 10 times for the teams, one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and tenth and final time. After ten times, we got the Philadelphia Eagles down to the Los Angeles Rams. All right, so Roy with the Eagles, Anthony of the Dolphins. Sean with the Packers, Conrad with the Patriots, Ryan with the Niners, Roy with the Chargers, Travis with the Bills, Sean with the Falcons, Mike Tower with the Ravens, Travis with the Saints, Joe P with the Jacksonville Jaguars, Ryan with the Broncos, Conrad with the J-E-T-S, Jets, 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 William Punt with the Vikings, Travis with the Redskins, Bill with the Bears, Logan with the Texans, Roy with the Titans, Sean with the Colts, Mikey got the Chiefs, Edwin with the Buccaneers, Ryan with the Browns, Joe P with the Steelers, Travis with the Giants, Ryan with the Cowboys, Bill with the Bengals, Anthony with my Raiders, Roy with the Lions, William with the Cardinals, Logan with the Seahawks, Edwin with the Panthers, and last but not least, Sean with the Rams. Let's sort by team, and feel free to trade if you'd like, and while you are trading, Let's pop open that fresh case and see which six we're gonna do. So we'll pop open this case. So I have all these numbered one, two, three, four, five, six. And let's, uh, I guess we'll use the same dice roll. And we'll do the top three boxes. After, once again, four and a six, ten times. We did ten for your names, ten for the teams, and now ten for the boxes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and tenth and final time. After ten, we're gonna do box four, two, and one. Four, two, and one. There we go, four, two, and one. Any trades? No trades? All right, TWC, trade window closed. Let's do this. We're gonna turn off the Nick cam really quick because we can play a couple quick, a few quick rounds of who am I? I'll give 
you some clues. You try to guess who's on the jersey. It's going to be one of those guys right there, among others. It's an example of what we can get. Wait, is Adam not in this break? Ray was the one that wanted this break to happen. Where did he go? Well, the second half is already in the store, folks. Jaspiescasebreaks.com if you missed this half. All right. Oh. And obviously, the team will be obvious because of the color of the team. If it happens to be their college jersey, um, then it'll go to the team that they played for uh, the longest. We'll use our non-pro uniform rules. So, like that Junior Seau right there in his USC gear, but although he only played for, no, yeah, I guess he played for the Dolphins and the Patriots a little bit, but he played for the Chargers the longest, so it'll go to that. All right, so now that we got that business out of the way, who am I? Guess for bragging rights, I'm a retired NFL quarterback, played for four teams my entire career, four-time Pro Bowler, an NFL Comeback Player of the Year winner, a Heisman Trophy finalist. I had a career 22,446 passing yards, threw 133 touchdowns to 88 uh, interceptions. I also rushed for 6,109 yards and rushed for 36 touchdowns. Who am I? I've played for, this is not my jersey, but I played for the Steelers. I played for the Jets. I've played for the Eagles. And I played for this team, which is the jersey that I'm wearing right now. Went to Virginia Tech. Yep, I think people are getting it now. Virginia Tech drafted in 2001. Round one, pick one. It's Michael Vick. Nice. So you get his autograph there. The JSA sticker there. The Vick on the back. These are custom jerseys, so they won't have their, you know, there's no team logos or NFL shields or anything like that. So I'll just keep it nicely folded in here, but... Pretty nice autograph. You get the JSA card inside here, too. Nice. So that's clearly Atlanta Falcons colors. So who's that going to go to? That will go to Sean W., who had the Atlanta Falcons. Nice. Nice. Remember, second half is in the store, folks, so please check it out. And let's just break one. Half case break number one. Nice. Next box. Good luck, everyone. <laughs> Quite a redemption story for Michael Vick, after all the dogfighting stuff. I think some people who, who, who are in a scandal such as that kind of just say sorry and go out of the public light, but he's done a lot of work with like animal rights organizations and stuff like that afterwards, and he's in a pretty good place. All right, next one. All right, who am I? I'm another quarterback, but I'm an active quarterback in the National Football League. I stand at 6'4", 231 pounds, and I played for one team my entire career. I'm a Pro Bowler, a Heisman Trophy Award winner, a BCS National Champion as well, 
AP Collegiate Player of the Year, an ACC Player of the Year, ACC Rookie of the Year, ACC Offensive Rookie of the Year. It kind of gets, gives you an idea of the college. Um, I've thrown for 15,000 yards in my career, 90 touchdowns to 61 interceptions, nine rushing touchdowns. Went to Florida State. Yeah, people are getting it now. Round one, pick one in 2015, just like Michael Vick. Another first round, first overall. It's the famous Jameis Winston. David Francois got it first. Then it was Jeremy Anderson, MT, cap cards. There you go. You guys all got it. Kind of a big season for him. I feel like this this has to be like the year where, hey, am I going to be a starting quarterback for the rest of my career? Am I going to take the next step forward? Pretty important time. I like the, the Buccaneers colors here too. That's pretty nice. All right, Buccaneers. That goes to Edwin Hack and the Tampa Bay Bucks. There's the JSA card in there too. You'll get all that. Sergeant Squid says, I'm a Bucks fan, but don't like Winston. I think it's going to have to be, it's sort of a show me season for Jameis Winston. You know, because I think a lot of fans feel that way. This is the same conversation people are having about Marcus Mariota, who didn't look that great last night. This is the same conversation people are going to have about my guy, Derek Carr. You know, I mean, I think I think there, there's like you're getting to that point of their contracts and their their careers where you're like, okay, now is it are you going to be a franchise quarterback or are you just going to be? Or are we going to have to be looking for another quarterback in the next however many years? You know what I mean? So it's getting to that point. Yeah, even David's saying exactly, exactly the same thing. He expected so much more from him by now. That's good. There are a lot of quarterbacks that are – because I, I want to say – I don't follow college as closely, but I want to say that there are – I want to say that there are a number of kind of highly touted college quarterbacks kind of coming out in the next year or two. I know Tua. Tua next year might be a big name. And then I think even a year after that, there may be some others too. So some of these teams have to think about, hey, do we move on, try another quarterback? All right, who am I? I'm an active wide receiver in the National Football League, obviously. This is still football. Played for one team my entire career. I, uh, I have career 71 receptions, 953 receiving yards, two receiving touchdowns. And I have uh, 172 rushing yards as well. I'm a late first-round pick from last year. Pick 24. You guys remember pick 24? First round last year, went to Maryland, and uh, was born in Philly, and went to Imhotep Institute Charter in Philadelphia before going off to Maryland for college. I think I was pretty good in college, I want to say. But uh, PFWA, all-rookie team, and Richter Howard, receiver of the year, all-first team Big Ten. I think he didn't do much last year, but I think this year could be a big year for him. He had 55 catches and 788 yards last year. That's not bad. Just a couple touchdowns. But I feel like I feel like he's looked pretty good this year so far. Yep, David, David's got it again. David, DJ Moore, Daniel Edwards, DJ Moore. That's right. This DJ be DJ Moore. There's his autograph. There's his JSA. JSA card in here, too. And who has the pant? Edwin again? Come on. Some guys have all the luck. Edwin got randomized. The Panthers gets the DJ Moore. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. A few nice jerseys there. Pretty solid stuff. The second half of this case is in the store right now. So check it out on jazbeescasebreaks.com. And we'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.